Hey class, I'm Mr Thornton and I just wanted to take a moment to try and answer a question which has been asked by an awful lot of you. And that is, why do I call my videos Get That C in Your GCSE? Why not aim for an A star? This is being asked in one form or another by the following people. Nisma X, Maid 786, IITomV, Chuck Norris Grammar Police, Ariana Gomez, by Flair, Hornby Crazy, Ashley Forrest, Quirky Girl, Sarah Ahmad, Sunshine Rose 78, Dennis M2, Chloe Taylor, Gigza 7, Ryan Brain, Abby Thampi, Raisa Ilyas, Nadia Akhtar, Charlotte 1999, Tia Spencer, BTK Edits, Jacob Roy, Janelle A, Kathy Hawkins, Samuel Nesbitt, Known as Nerds, Lukman Patel, Carter Addy, 11 Ashraf N1, uh, Mr. Awesome 53, good name, Mariam Islam, Lone Wolf, Kaza Hawes, and Ewan Big Toe Joyce. It's great that so many of you are interested though in the answer to that question, so I just wanted to explain. Basically, the way the course specification for AQA is laid out is kind of like this. This is an actual example from the course specification. You'll notice that there are parts of it which are in normal type and there are parts of it which are in bold type. The parts which are in normal type, everyone needs to know whether or not you're doing foundation tier or higher tier. So, if you're doing foundation tier and the highest grade that you can get is a C, then you need to know all the bits which are in normal type. If you're doing higher tier, then you need to know all the bits which are in normal type and the bits in bold type as well. Those are the bits which take you up to the higher grades. They're more challenging, they have a higher level of demand. And so that's the way that I've organized my own videos. I'm trying to reflect the way which it's organized in the course specification. I originally started doing this because I had a class full of students who were all sitting the foundation tier and I really didn't think there were an awful lot of resources which were specifically aimed at them because everyone was focusing on the A star students. But there have been so many people asking for A star resources that I've started doing those as well. So if you want to know which bits you need to do, then all you need to do is look at the thumbnails for my videos. If it's a red, a green, or a blue thumbnail, then that is a Get That C video. Those ones are for everyone, for foundation tier and higher tier as well. If you're doing higher tier, then what you need to do is look out for the videos which have a white background, like these ones, and those are the top grade top of videos which will take you through the more challenging parts of the higher tier specification. And they'll take you to that higher level, those are the ones which you need to look at to make sure that you're going to get that A star that you're aiming for. Okay, so, red, green and blue are the foundation tier things which everyone needs to be able to do. And the ones in white there, those are the ones for the higher tier students, they're the top grade top of. Occasionally, just to be a little bit more complicated, I might do a video which is half and half like this one. This is one where there's an awful lot of foundation tier content for everyone and just one little bit of higher tier content that it really doesn't make sense doing an entire video for all by itself. I hope that's cleared up the question and I hope that makes things a little bit easier for everyone to understand. But if not, as ever, do feel free to leave a comment below and I'll try and make things even more Thanks very much for watching and good luck in your exams.